everybody, it's Weather Anchor Mama. Thanks so much for tuning in. You know, Halloween is just around the corner and I wanted to do something fun with Princess. You know, last year we went to the pumpkin patch and we had a great time, but of course we had a little hiccup along the way. Take a look. She needed her binky and we forgot it at home. So it was a pretty long 20 minute drive, the longest ever. <laughs> but we did have a lot of fun. This year, I wanted to get a little crafty. We really didn't have time to paint our pumpkin last year. We couldn't do a jack o' lantern. We couldn't do any carving or anything like that. Plus, she was a little too young and really wasn't into it. So I went to the craft store and just got these little cutouts of pumpkins. They come in a little pack and they're like $1.50. And we also got this, ooh, I don't wanna mess up your creation. We also got this little <laughs> cutout here. It's like made of wood and this was like maybe 150 or two bucks or something. And we get coupons online. So you can always check for coupons online if you go to like Michael's or you could even hit up the dollar store and get some of these. They're really inexpensive. They mean Michael's house. Yeah, we went to Michael's house. <laughs> She's talking about the craft store. Um, <laughs> and we got some water-based paint, right? They're non-toxic. Okay, we get more pumpkin here. See, got another one. And I'm not really concerned about her getting any on her clothes. It's water-based. It'll wash right out. But, of course, you can always put on a smock or something to perfect to prevent the paint from getting on to your little one's clothes. Are you having fun? Let me help you. And, um, you know, it's really simple, and it's something that, you know, you and your kids could enjoy, and it's just super easy. Uh, this only cost, again, this was like maybe $1.50 for a whole pack of like 10 or so, and um, then you have this, it was like 2 bucks. So sometimes it's good to get a little creative. Of course, if you have any pumpkins and you want to cut that out and make a jack-o'-lantern and make it fun, that's also a good option. But we just wanted to keep it simple this year. And we'll be back at the pumpkin patch, hopefully soon. <laughs> All right, let me know what you're doing this year for Halloween. And um, leave your comments below. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Bye.